All right, so today we're going to be looking at just girly things. What's that? It's not 2011. It's not 2011? Nah, mate, it's 2017. Oh, right. So if any of you guys had Facebook from about, I'd say, 2007 to 2012, then you would have seen one of these before. Now, if you aren't familiar with what this is, they're called Just Girly Things. They've got a photo in the background and then text that says something that girls can relate to, apparently. And we're going to take a look at a few today because they can get pretty ridiculous. Now, I never usually ask for likes before I do the video. I leave it to the end. But if this video reaches 600 likes, which is, you know, pretty rare, then I'll do a part two and I'll look at even more. Watching the Titanic. <laughs> that could just be with anything. Watching Shrek 2. Watching The Exorcist. It works with anything. But I'll let it slide because I guess that's kind of like a romantic relationship goal sort of thing. Trying to forget him, but he's all you think about. Why is she sitting on a fence? What has that got to do with anything about the caption? The photo looks like it was taken at a photo shoot. So, I mean, I wonder what the girl thinks. If the girl in the photo is just scrolling through her Facebook feed and she sees this. Trying to forget him, but he's all you think about. What? I was just at a photo shoot. Not wanting to go to school. Does anyone want to go to school? This isn't just girly things. This is just everyone on the planet things. At least with this one, the photo actually fits with the caption. But this is definitely not just girly things. I relate to this too, and I'm not a girl. Laughing about everything without having any reason. I mean, that would be pretty weird, wouldn't it? Yo, I've got some bad news. I went to uh, feed your fish and found out that he was dead. Oh, really? <laughs> Drinking coffee every morning. <laughs> Everyone does that, okay? This isn't even a goal. This is just something you do on an everyday basis. I can understand the watching the Titanic one because that's kind of like a goal that couples have. This is just an everyday thing. When your hand gets warm from holding your coffee. I'm not being funny, mate, but your hand's not gonna get freezing cold when you're holding a boiling cup of coffee. Do you expect your hand to get cold or something? No, it's gonna get warm. Firstly, this isn't even a goal. Like, I guess it's relatable, obviously. Anyone can relate to getting warm hands when holding a boiling cup of coffee. And that brings me on to my next point. This isn't just something girls can relate to. This is not just girly things. Again, this is everyone on the planet who holds a cup of coffee things. Waking up to new messages. The only messages I wake up to are my own followers telling me to go f myself. <laughs> Not being afraid to take chances and try new things. And then it shows a picture of a girl getting licked by a cow. Is that the best photo you could have used? The caption is all about taking risks and trying new things and getting out of your comfort zone. It would have been a much better choice to use a photo of maybe someone skydiving or bungee jumping. Not a photo of a girl getting licked by a cow. You don't wake up in the morning and think, oh wow, you know, I feel like doing something new today. I might go to a field and get licked by a cow. I mean, if that's your thing, then uh, go, go for it. That feeling you get when you know someone has used you. Is that the same girl? from the cow photo. Wow. I mean, I guess this is kind of like a story then. Maybe she was feeding the cow grass and hay, and uh, you know, after the cow ate the grass and hay, he walked off back to the farm, and boom. That feeling you get when you know someone has used you. Oh my god, man, that's sad. Let me, let me just take a minute, silence. Realizing that distance is just a number. What is the meaning behind this one? The only number that comes to my mind when I want to travel somewhere is the money that it costs. For example, I would really love to go to America one day, but you know how much a flight costs? That's the only number that comes to my mind. I don't know, actually. Maybe that is what it's trying to say. Having long hair. I mean, uh, th there's not much to this one, is there really? Having long hair, that's it. I'm gonna keep saying this, man. This isn't just girly things. I know men who have long hair. When he kisses you unexpectedly, well, that can go one of two ways. Um, and if it goes the wrong way, you're gonna find yourself in jail. Honestly, mate, it's a risk, but if it's a risk you wanna take, go for it. Having your mouth wide open when putting on mascara. I thought these were supposed to be goals, you know, like uh, watching the Titanic relationship goals. I don't see the point behind this one. Well, actually, one thing I will give it is that this is just girly things, okay? This is something that just girls relate to, so yeah, maybe that's why I don't get it. Okay, so let's not drop the mic. Okay, so I just finished editing the video the, you're all the way up to what you've seen now. And I realized that it's not too short, but it could be a little bit longer. So I'm going to go through a few more. Uh, not many, but you know, just to add a few extra minutes onto the video. Silence is a girl's loudest cry. Again, what is it with the photos that don't even have anything to do with the caption? Like, it's just a girl in a field. It, lo it looks like it was taken from a photo shoot. Imagine if she's seen this on her Facebook feed. Watching your pet grow from a kitten to a cat. 
Firstly, what if my pet is a dog? Watching your dog grow from a kitten to a cat. <laughs> the caption just kind of doesn't make sense. It's like watching your pet grow from a kitten to a cat. What if my pet is like a fish? Watching your fish grow from a kitten to a cat. I get what you mean, but it could have been worded better. Putting Bowser on your pet, you know, judging by his face, I don't think he likes that, but you know, I'll let you do you. Watching beauty videos on YouTube. Oh, I could do the same one with my channel, couldn't I? Watching Polar Source Rex videos on YouTube. Yeah, I think that that's more like it. When you realize he's the one you want to grow old with. Not being funny, mate, but if you stay on that train track for just a little bit longer, none of you are going to get any older. Building walls so that no one can hurt you. Oh, I remember this one. I made a meme with it in the past. You know in COD Zombies when you uh, build up the window so the zombies can't get in? I, I put that underneath it. I thought it was pretty funny at the time. Don't cry because it's over. Smile because it happened. And that's how I'm going to end the video, guys. Don't cry because it's over. Smile because if this video gets 600 likes, there's going to be a part two. And I've already done the outro to this video a few hours ago, so uh, let's go back in time real quick. But yeah, that is going to wrap it up for the video guys i hope you all enjoyed the video like i said i will do a part two if you guys like it so like i said at the start of the video 600 likes i'll do a part two 600 likes really shows that you guys like the video so definitely hit that and i'll do a part two because there are thousands of these that i could go through yeah thank you all for watching i hope you all enjoyed definitely subscribe to my channel if you're new here and if you want to watch other similar videos that i've done to this you can check out the uh, relationship goals videos similar things but instead of looking at just girly things i looked at the cringy relationship goals things i've done two of those videos so if you want to check them out I'll probably put them on the screen or something or link them in the description. But other than that, thank you all for watching and I will see you all in my next video.